Meanwhile, UK's nuclear energy sector is all set to get a makeover with Prime Minister Rishi Sunak likely to announce plans to increase the nuclear workforce. The UK government will now invest about $250 million to ensure that the northern England town of Barrow in Furness remains a major nuclear submarine building hub. The investment will also lead to more jobs and improvements in the transport infrastructure. The government will also partner with defense companies, Bay Systems, Rolls-Royce and Babcock International to invest over $950 million by the end of the decade. So now, sir, I'm quoting here, safeguarding the future of our nuclear deterrent and nuclear energy industry is a critical national endeavor. The nuclear energy industry is forecast to create 40,000 new jobs by 2030. The government needs to ensure there is, there, that there are sufficient nuclear workers to maintain its fleet of submarines which are important for defense and security. Britain's uh, nuclear submarine industry will expand in the coming years as new boats are built for the UK and Australia under the AUKUS Security Pact.